be careful what you wish for, or maybe not. For Jason Stevens, a tweet became a reality. That looks nice, though. With the black, I like it. <laughs> it was unreal. Now, you know, after the first one, everybody's looking around like my friends, and then, you know, the, the second one happens, and everybody just. So, yeah, yeah, it was, it was pretty cool. When Tesho Akindeli showed up and scored not one but two goals, Jason knew he would be getting the maple leaf tattooed. For a lot of people, tattoos are like the story of your life, or a little bit about who you are. And Jason's a huge FC Dallas fan. And obviously that game was like huge for the team, huge moment for him. It was really exciting for me as well, you know. So I guess that's just one good story that he has and he decided to put that on his body. It was cool because, I mean, everything just kind of came together. Um, you know, uh, he reached out and thought it was an awesome idea and that somebody was going to do it. So, um, yeah, and then he offered to come down and, and see it. So, yeah, it was, it was really cool. Now Jason has a cool story to go along with his tattoo. We don't see that very often. It's really nice to see a player interact with a fan that, you know, is wanting to do something like this. You know, I mean, how many fans come in every day and get, you know, a logo for this team or something regarding, you know, something they're into, um, and they'll never see the person or the team or a member of that team ever. So this guy, you know, coming out and being a part of it is really awesome. As for Jason, this might not be the last time we hear from him. You know, if, uh... If FC Dallas wins the cup, uh, maybe Dan Hunt wants to get the crest with the star tattooed above it. I'll do the same. Uh, we can have a bet. So. <laughs> Janet Sanchez, FC Dallas.com.